Slow and steady is a conversion method we developed that literally works as it sounds. The idea is to gradually cut back the amount of old food that you're offering your bird every day while gradually increasing the amount of new food. The goal is to take away the old food at night so that in the morning he's hungrier and more apt to try the new food. First thing in the morning when you offer the new food, be sure to put it in the same cup you feed him in every single day so that he doesn't suspect that there's something going on. If he starts eating that new food, be sure to praise him. Use his name, scratch his head if that's what he likes, anything that will encourage him to try that new food. If your bird isn't excited about the pellets, one thing you can try is to moisten them with a little bit of warm water or warm fruit juice to encourage him to try them. But just be sure not to leave the moist food in the cage for more than a couple of hours or it may spoil. Okay, so let's say your bird still isn't interested in new food. You can offer him a small amount of old food in a separate cup. Just remember not to take out the new food and never mix them. One thing to keep in mind is that if you do offer your bird some of his older food in the evening, he may not want to eat the new food overnight because he may not be hungry. So don't be alarmed if the new food is somewhat untouched in the morning. The idea here is to gradually extend the time that the bird has access only to the new food, from four hours to six hours and then longer. But don't be afraid if your bird doesn't eat for four to six hours because a healthy bird can go four to six hours without eating. One thing to remember when you're converting your bird to pellets is to not offer him too much of the old food, just enough so that he's not hungry. Remember, when you're going through this process, it's not unusual for a bird to lose weight because they're going from a high-fat seed diet, usually, to a more nutritious pelleted diet. It's a good idea to keep a scale on hand, and if your bird loses more than 10% of his body weight, you should alert your veterinarian. When you follow these steps, slow and steady really works. It's great for conure-sized birds and larger who use their feet to eat. It could take a couple of weeks to transition your bird to this new pelleted diet, but it's definitely worth it.